<laughs> City man. School sure is boring. I can't wait to get home and type in the new program from Execute Magazine. Oh yeah? That sounds like fun. You sound different. What gives? Oh, it may be because my character was recast and now it's being voiced by me, BitBarn. BitBarn? What's that? It's a BitBarn. You know, a thing around here. It eats people, which is a joke that won't make any sense for a few more minutes. Oh, okay. That's cool. Well... Why don't you come over later? You can meet at the program listing while I type it in. All right. Sounds like a plan. Awesome. 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 Billy, your father and I are going out to the party. Don't have anyone over and make sure that you do the dishes and clean the kitchen. And no modem. You don't want to repeat of last year, do you? Uh, yeah, right. Stupid parents. What was that? Oh, uh, sure, Mom. No modem. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. Do 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 do. Looking for the type in program. It's open. Hey, man. I had to do some chores before I came over. Anyway, where's the magazine? What type in program is it? Oh, it's called Pony Time. I thought it would be a really cool game to play. Dude, I heard that if you type in that program, a middle-aged brony will appear and start lecturing you on why Applejack is so much better than Glitter Sprinkle Prancer. Dude, what's a brony? It's a sign of the end of Western civilization, which is a thing around here. But I guess it's not any more stupid than computer puppets. Oh, well here's one called Alternating Realities. It's written by some guy named, what, Scratches Poker? Let's try that one. Scratches poker, it's still a lame name. I wonder if he knows how that sounds. Lamer! Lamer. Deja, Deja vu! vu. Oh, wow, it felt like reality just shifted. That was weird. Sounds better than pony time. Much better. Okay, well, let's get started. Let's see here. Ten rim, alternating realities. Twenty rim. Scratches poker. Oh well, you can skip the rims, I guess. Wait, did you just notice something change? I uh, I didn't notice anything. Huh. Anyway, next line. Thirty. Go sub. Seems, seems, seems. Okay. Dude, you're right. I saw it that time. When I hit enter, the soda can changed from Jolt Cola to Tab Cola. Nah, man. It's always been Tab. I love it. And it's only one calorie. Whatever. Let's just keep going. Okay. Next line. 40. Print. Clear screen. So far, it seems like a pretty standard program. I guess it's better than Pony Time, anyway. 50. Print. What is your name? 60. Input. NM string. Wow, did you see that? All of my heavy metal tapes changed. They're now the same Barry Manilow self-titled album, Manilow. That's so lame. Dude, you've always loved the Manilow. Quit messing with me and let's just type this thing in. Aw, oh, Matt, we're going to be here all night. This is going to take forever to type this in. Why don't you get your mom to buy you an optical recognition program so you can just scan it in? I would, but she says I have to wait for something called flatbed scanners and OCR platforms. Parents are so stupid. Wait, where are we? This isn't your room. Huh? When did I get a free soda machine and cheesy snack dispenser? Free sodas and chips? Oh, never mind. The soda machine only has tab in it, and it looks like the cheese snacks are all sold out. And there's only a few out-of-date bags of pretzels. Lame. Tab and pretzels? Awesome! Dude, I don't even know you. That is just... Lame. Lame, lame, lame. Let's just finish this up. Just the next line. Let's see. 
2200. Rim, good evening, Billy and Tim. Wait, that's our names. Weird coincidence, don't you think? Kind of freaky in a way. Anyway, next line is 2210. Install Demon Gate at 312 decimal 421, comma, negative 4165 decimal 123, comma, 734 decimal 32. I don't remember that being a valid basic command, but okay. Oh, cool, look. A swirly portal looking thing just opened up at the foot of your bed. Portal? Radical! Radical! Hello, Billy. Hello, Tim. Thanks for talking in my perfect. Wait, who are you? You shouldn't be here. Why is my C64 a Sinclair 1000 now? Why are all my transformers now GoBot? Since, so, since when did I have Masterpiece Theater bed sheet? GoBots and Masterpiece Theater? It's gonna be a great night. I'm gonna go get my things for a sleepover. Wait! It's okay. Tim will be back with all his things. He might never leave. Or he may be in my schmoo. But why is he so lame now? And what's a schmoo? What was that? Oh, um, uh, I guess he found a schmoo. Anyway, a schmoo is a thing around here. It eats people. Never mind all that. Just forget about Tim for the moment. This is a great room, isn't it? The ZX Spectrum and all the tag you can drink. Pretzels. To make me thirsty and cool tunes. Everything a teenage boy could ever want. Why, just wait until you see what's between your mattress now. No, I want you to leave. I want my 64 back. I want my heavy metal tapes. I want my room back the way it was. You're not welcome here. <laughs> Make sure he's safe and programmed. Wouldn't want him to go and disappear from this reality now, would you? Wouldn't want to undo all of my changes or anything, would you? Ah, so all I have to do to make you go away is turn off the power. Oh no, please don't. That was easier than I thought. If you had saved the program, I would have been imprisoned on the cassette. Now, you've made this reality perfect. Don't worry, Billy. We'll see if the new and improved team can stay the never in the weekend after all. I hear he wants to show you his grandmother's spoon collection and share a fascinating tidbit about each and every one of them. <laughs> no! Thank you.